the Miami Dolphins weren't draft pick rich last season. Still, the players they selected expect to have a more significant role during their sophomore season than their rookie. Of the new additions, two players, in particular, stand out for making impactful contributions during the 2022 season, only four rookies heard their names called by the Miami Dolphins last April. Channing Tindall, Eric Azucana, Cameron Good, and Skylar Thompson, we know Thompson had plenty of opportunities and reps during a season with oft-injured quarterback play. What Thompson accomplished on the field was enough to not only garner a playoff game start but also allow some to consider him a viable backup behind Tua Tagovailoa seriously. Good spent most of the year on the team's practice squad after being cut following the preseason, however, he did impress coaches enough to warrant a return stint, that leaves the former Georgia linebacker in Tyndall and the former Texas Tech wide receiver, Ezukanma. Each has their respective expectations to meet. Eyeing their second season as professionals. The Dolphins need them both to stride toward meaningful minutes, but which one will be in a better position for more snaps and success? Channing Tyndall linebacker, Miami used a third-round pick on the Georgia prospect, with the expectations that he'd be at least a contributor in some role, either spelling the starters or on special teams. The linebacker played just nine snaps on defense throughout the entire season. Admittedly, Tyndall expressed that difficulty learning an NFL playbook slowed down his growth and opportunities this past season. His last meaningful game action came during Week 9 against the Bears when the defense needed anyone capable to try and contain Justin Fields. Tyndall will likely be considered for a more active role on a squad that signed several veteran linebackers to one-year deals last year. Special teams is still a more reasonable bet, Eric Azucanma wide receiver. Fans clamored for the Texas Tech product to see more playing time after a preseason that showed his connection with Thompson and lighting up backup defensive units. However, the wide receiver was a healthy scratch for most of the year and only saw snaps during the season's last regular season game. Ezukanma is another rookie who struggled to learn the playbook and was buried under loads of talent at the position. There's a chance the latter issue clears up as the team sheds contracts, Cedric Wilson, and decides whether to spend on pending free agents Trent Sherfield and River Crockraft, Ezukanma has the best shot at carving a more notable role and will need to use the offseason to grasp the playbook better and make an impact in year two. The opportunities should be there for, at least. Consistent rotation playing time.